Hey YouTube, this is Computer Hacker 16, and today I'm bringing you a new tutorial. And in this tutorial, I'm gonna be showing you a not a very helpful tutorial, but this tutorial is helpful for those people that bought a computer that or was used and it was registered by by another person that that is not you, which means it's another owner. So. Basically, this tutorial is going to be on how to change the name of the owner of your computer. Uh, if you bought a used computer or somebody else registered your computer with another name, but it's not yours. The way to know for Windows XP, this works for all Windows. For Windows XP, to know the way um, to to know who registered your computer or the name of the owner, you're going to go to Start, right click on my computer, then go to Property. And then after you got a properties a box like the system properties should pop up and it should give all the information uh, it doesn't give it a mind because this is Windows 7 and I think um, this works for for Windows 7 and it, you go to start type in run and then type in Winver W-I-N-V-E-R right there Winver and then after you type that you're gonna click OK and it should bring you this this box uh, this tells you everything about like if it's uh, license activated the uh, version and uh, the owner that registered this computer uh, so as you can see right now on my it says this product is licensed under the Microsoft software license terms 2 and then it says my name so yeah it's registered to me and to change that if you bought a used computer like I said um, to change that we're gonna tweak the registry uh, so what you wanna do is go to start uh, XP users go to run Vista and Windows XP and Windows Vista I mean in Windows 7 I'm oh, sorry about that um, type in run and then what you wanna type in or run type in reject it reject it click OK and then the reject it window should pop up um, right now once it's not open but yeah so in here it gives you five choices the one you that you want to expand is HKey local machine expanded what you want to expand next is software expanded now what you want to do is go to uh, find Microsoft and expand it. Now scroll down and find Windows NT. Windows NT right there. So expand Windows NT. Then expand. Now what you do not expand current version. Just leave it as it is. Just click on it, but do not expand current version. So once you expand Windows NT. You wanna you're gonna find the folder which is current version. Do not expand it. Just click on it. And at the right hand side, it would give you you're gonna you're gonna need to find registry registered owner. And as you can see, mine is right there. It says my name. So if it's registered with another name or you wanna change it, just click on that registered owner. Then I'm just gonna put hacker sixteen. Then I'll click OK. Also, you can change the product name, product name which is mine is Windows 7 Ultimate. I don't want to change that, but if you want to change it, you can. So once you say change the registered owner and the product name, you want to close reject it, and you want to check back again on Windows XP. Just right click on my computer, go to Properties, on Windows Vista and Windows 7. Just go to Run. And type in Winver. Winver. W I N V E R. Click OK. And as you can see now, it changed it. So now it says this product is licensed under the Microsoft Software License Terms to Hacker 16, which I which we just tweaked or we just put. So this was a little but kind of helpful tutorial if you bought a used computer. So I hope you enjoyed this tutorial and if you did please subscribe, rate and comment. I'll see you guys later. Bye bye.